how's it going? My name is Crystal and today I want to talk about an interesting book that I recently read and it's called The Bling Ring and it's by Nancy Jo Sales. I believe I'm saying the author's name right. I'm very sorry if I'm mispronouncing any of those words. But yes, it's called The Bling Ring and it's about the real life like true crime story of the gang known as the Bling Ring in Los Angeles who wound up robbing celebrities' homes actually over $3 million worth of items and they stole all kinds of things from all kinds of celebrities. If you've heard of it, you probably have just heard all these articles at one point in time and maybe saw the news stories or you saw the film called The Bling Ring uh, by Sofia Coppola starring Emma Watson. Like, this book was super interesting in all the detail it gave to the whole gang of The Bling Ring. I found out some of these people actually have done jail time and you know, they thought they were going to get away with it for a while. The fact that these kids got so obsessed with, like, celebrities' fashion and clothing, and I was talking about this with a friend recently, and I told them what I was reading, and about this audiobook, and they said, oh, you know, these celebrities shouldn't have been dumb enough to have all these, you know, valuables in their home, and then I looked at it from the sense of, you know, you don't want someone coming into your house and robbing you blind of, like, tons of stuff that you like, and I tried to see it from that perspective. Yes, these are celebrities and they can easily replace their things, but also it's about invading someone's privacy in someone's home. This is a place you're supposed to feel safe no matter who you are in the world. And I just couldn't believe how kind of, I guess, cavalier, if that's the right word, that these kids were. These were teenagers robbing celebrities and no one knew what was going on. For a while, they got away with it until they were getting found out and then they got in trouble for it. And it's just so funny how even... Some of them were like, but I didn't do anything, and I didn't do anything. Some of them thought, literally, if I just say the right thing, or if I just give everything back, will you just let me go? One of the girls actually was like, if I just tell you what everything is, will you just let me go? It's like, that's not how this works. That's that's not what happened. You committed a crime, and then you broke into someone's home, and you did it multiple times to multiple people. Yeah, you're gonna get in trouble. And I just thought this audiobook was very interesting. It was very fun to listen to, and the author made it pretty interesting. There were moments that I was like, okay, I get it. I feel like this is more the author's opinion than sort of an overall opinion that the reader could take away. But I understand when you're sort of like frustrated that this even happened to someone, and let alone multiple people over months at a time and the fact that these children these were kids doing this and they made off nearly five million dollars worth of just like things upon things and then they stole like money and jewels and diamonds and purses and watches and just all kinds of things that it's just like between all of these celebrities that they stole from they took just all kinds of stuff and they wanted to take more this whole story of the bling ring and the events that happened and this book was just so interesting to see it from this type of perspective because I haven't read it, like a true crime novel or anything like this in a really long time or listened to an audiobook like this for a while. I definitely would say if this is a story that ever interested you, check out the book from the perspective of listening to the audiobook. It was just something that helped me pass the time. It was also very intriguing to learn more things about each member of the bling ring and to see the events kind of from those perspectives and how everything unfolded for them and their thoughts on the matter on how it affected their lives anyways thank you guys for watching and i will see you all next time in another video